everyone. My name is Miss Sophia from the Family Involvement Center in Montgomery County, Maryland. And today for our arts and craft activity, we are going to be doing ice cube art. So here are the things that you will need. You will need some paper. You will need an ice cube. And you will need some markers. Let's take a closer look at all of the things that we will need. All right, so what we're going to do first is you are going to take your markers and you are going to draw a picture. So I think today I'm going to draw a picture of my favorite shape, which is a heart. What is your favorite shape? Oh, some people like circles, squares, rectangles, triangles, and ovals. Well, I'm going to do a heart but you can draw whatever you want. So I'm going to draw my heart and I think I'm going to make my heart four different colors. I'm going to make it the color pink, blue, purple, and red. All right, so let me start. And you can take a closer look at me drawing my heart. I wanted to make a heart that fills up the entire page. And then I'm going to put some different colors in my heart. So first I'm using pink. Okay. And then next, I'm going to use red. to do some quicker strokes here so I can fill everything up. And then I have purple. I use purple in the middle. And then I am going to use blue. How is your picture looking? Wow, I'm sure it's going to be very, very nice. I'm sure you put a lot of detail into the colors that you use and thinking about what you wanted to draw. Okay, so here is my heart. And so now what we're going to do is we're going to take our ice cube and we are going to move it along the paper and see what happens. Are you ready with your ice cube? All right, if you need more time, you can pause this video and come back to the part where we need our ice. Okay, everyone, are we ready for our ice now? Very good, so I have my ice cube here and I'm going to put the side that's flat on the paper. You can use the other side too, and I'm going to rub my ice cube over the paper. Let's take a closer look at what's happening. Wow. I think I am finished with my ice cube now and I'm gonna put it back in my container. So I'm gonna turn my picture around. What? happen when you put the ice cube on your markers. Yes, when we put the ice cube on our picture, it started to look like paint and some of the colors got lighter. So this almost looks like we painted it. So now what you can do is you can put this somewhere so that it can dry and then it will look so nice when you show other people and when you see it. You can do as many of these ice cube pictures as you would like. So let's take one more look at the heart. Very good, and I'm sure 
all of the wonderful things you drew turned out wonderful as well when you put the ice cube on it. All right, friends, thank you for joining me for Arts and Crafts. Make sure you comment below with your name so I can give you a special welcome. And maybe you can even tell me about what you drew or you can send pictures to our website, which is Family Involvement Center MD at gmail.com. Thank you, everyone. See you soon.